Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Herdio channel. Today's video is a follow-up to our video on the hardwired Herdio controller that we released last year. Perhaps our previous explanations left you a bit puzzled, especially with the lack of a demonstration on power socket integration. However, you can perfectly conceal the controller behind the wall, rather than placing the power source on the exposed surface. We hope this video will provide more detailed guidance to help you navigate through. Let's dive in. All right. To connect the controller to a 220 volts power source behind it, we'll need a transformer. The included power adapter essentially serves as a miniature transformer. And the key lies in how we can seamlessly conceal it along with the 220 volts power source. Firstly, let's open up the included 12 volts power adapter. Inside, you'll find a small transformer circuit board with two plug-in conductive components that will connect to the lid and neutral wires on the socket. This allows the voltage to be converted from 220 volts to 12 volts. Now, how can we perfectly conceal and integrate the transformer into the power socket? Let's start by connecting the live wire and neutral wire to the conductive components of the transformer. Then, strip the outer layer of the DC cable to expose a positive pole and a negative pole. Next, take out the included to pin 12 volts DC cable and hardwire the black wire to the black wire and the red wire to the red wire. If you've reserved a spot for speaker wires behind the wall, connect them as well. Finally, place the controller inside, cover it, turn on the power, and it will start working. So there you have it. With these steps, you can seamlessly integrate the transformer into the power socket, hide the controller behind the wall, and have everything set up for a smooth operation. Keep in mind these guidelines for a safe and efficient installation. However, feel free to explore alternative methods that may work better for you. We encourage you to share your insights and suggestions in the comments section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials and tips. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.